Hey, what's going on? Welcome back to English with Lingua Trip. And in this video, we're gonna open up a list of the most mispronounced states and cities in the US. So if you're ready, buckle up. Let's do it. Everything's in English. All you need to know. All right, how did you learn to speak English? All right, let's talk about it. This is the most mispronounced state in the US, Illinois. Right, Illinois, we know that. Illinois has a sound, silent S sound, so it should be pronounced Illinois, not Illinois. Yeah, we knew that. That's great, congratulations to us. Illinois. Colorado, Colorado, right? While you may have been saying Colorado, locals will tell you that it's better to say Colorado. Are you for real? Colorado with the second syllable rhyming with bad. I had no idea, I am so sorry, I don't know. Arkansas. Right? Is that how it is? Not Arkansas. Arkansas should be referred to as Arkansas instead of Arkansas. We knew that. We're not stupid. All right. It lives in Arkansas. Okay, okay, I got this one. So it's either Missouri or Missouri. Both are fine. I only know that from college because uh, someone I went to school with was from there. This Midwestern state actually has two pronunciations that are acceptable, Missouri and Missouri. We did it, guys. We did it. Missouri North Division. Florida? What's so special about Florida? Residents of the Sunshine State would argue that Florida should be pronounced with a Southern accent. Ah, uh, makes sense. They tend to draw out the word as Florida. Florida, I've heard people say that for sure. Florida, rather than focus on the hard R in the South Florida. Interesting, Florida. I've definitely heard people say that. Florida. Oregon, what's wrong with Oregon? We bet you've fallen for Oregon's tricky pronunciation. I didn't know it was even tricky to begin with. Originally, the state in the Pacific Northwest was most likely pronounced as Oregon. Oregon? That's crazy. However, over time, that changed to Oregon. Oregon, Oregon, okay? And today's most common pronunciation is Oregon. Yeah, okay. Okay, okay, that's cool. It's Oregon. Oregon. Nevada. What's tricky about Nevada? Uh, it's actually pronounced Nevada, not Nevada. Oh, Nevada. I've heard people say it like that. Wow, that's crazy. Nevada, like bad. Drop that jaw. Carson City, Nevada. I think some honorable mentions that we definitely should talk about that they didn't mention in the article. They're not as tricky as some of these, but still, you know, I think they're still worth mentioning. It's uh, Kentucky. Keene City, Kentucky. Texas. Where? Texas. Michigan, with a little sh. Michigan. 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 Connecticut. Connecticut, that's that's a good one, Connecticut. From Connecticut. California, with a a, a California. California, right? It's kind of tricky being able to see a, a word for the first time and then kind of guessing how to say it, you know, the pronunciation of it when you see for the first time. How do you do that? Well, you have to have a little more experience with pronunciation, well, with the language pronunciation, but also phonetics. It's not something that people really teach you. Actually, not anymore. I would like to invite you to our pronunciation course where we help you just get a little better. Doesn't mean you have to get rid of your accent completely unless you want to. You know, just gain a little more confidence, speak clearly, Sound like a native speaker if you want to, or sound close to a native speaker. Whatever you want, it's perfect for you. So if you want to learn a little more and potentially be, you know, a part of it, be my student, I'm gonna put the link in the description box down below. Check it out. It will be my honor to be your teacher and help you with that. Let's move on to Cities, I'm scared. 10 commonly mispronounced US city names to navigate your way around. Oh my God, number one is already crazy. I hate this word. Worcester, that's common popular pronunciations. Worcester, Worcester. I don't like any of them. Prevailing local pronunciation, Worcester. Are you serious right now? Worcester. And Worcester? Number two, uh, Louisville. We know that one. We know it's French, so when you see Louis, it's actually not Louis, it's actually Louis. Louisville, like Louis Vuitton, right? Louisville. My uh, wife and children are in Louisville, Kentucky. Uh, that's Spokane, right? Common popular pronunciation, Spokane. Spokane. Prevailing local pronunciation, Spokane. Spokane? Spokane. Okay. Being in Spokane, Washington. Uh, New Orleans, I think. Common popular pronunciations, New Orleans. 
New Orleans. Prevailing local pronunciation, New Orleans. Okay, that's that's how I said it. New Orleans. Tucson, 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 Tucson. Common popular pronunciation, prevailing local pronunciation, Tucson. Tucson, right? Yo, number six, uh, Des Moines. Common popular pronunciation, Des Moines. Oh, it's French, duh. So it's uh, Des Moines, right? Des Moines, Des Moines, that's what I said. Prevailing local pronunciation, Des Moines. I mean, look, look, we, we kind of got it. Ah, yes. The mighty, mighty lions of Des Moines. Number seven, what the hell is that? Raleigh? Common popular pronunciation, rally. Rally? Like the one in North Carolina? Uh, number eight, Mobile, Alabama. Common popular pronunciation, Mobile. Prevailing local pronunciation, Mobile. Mobile, Alabama, that's crazy. Kissing me? That's kissing me, right? Common popular pronunciation, kissing me. Oh, that's what I said. Oh, I'm in trouble. Prevailing local pronunciation, Kissimmee? That's the stress? Those are coordinates to Kissimmee, Florida. Oh, 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 okay, number 10, I got number 10. I know, I know, it's Poughkeepsie, right? Poughkeepsie? I've heard that somewhere. I feel like someone said it to me before or mentioned it some, for some reason. Poughkeepsie, I just remember hearing that. Common popular pronunciation is Poughkeepsie. That sounds weird as hell. Prevailing local pronunciation, Poughkeepsie. Poughkeepsie, for example. <laughs> Very interesting to see how different, uh, you know, the names of places came from other languages, obviously, because of the history and all of that. We're not gonna get into that too much, but I have a challenge for you now. I'm gonna show you names of some cities or towns on the screen, and you have to guess how to say it, and then I'll tell you what it is, okay? The first one is on the screen right now. So it's Boise. I've heard some people say with an S, Boise. I heard, I've heard some people say with a Z, Boise. So I guess it's up to you, Boise, Idaho. And Barbara, who lives in Boise, Idaho. The next one. Cam, well, okay, I guess we gotta do it right. Camarillo, California. Camarillo, California. It's not English, remember. And the last one. La Jolla, California, also not English. Pretty cool, huh? How'd you like to spend the weekend in La Jolla with me, Sal? I hope you enjoyed this video. I don't know if you learned a lot from it or if it was super useful, but at least we had fun and learned something, right? Let me know if you like this format, you know, me just going on random websites and checking out the articles and trying to see if we can learn something from it. If you like it, I'll try to make more. You can also send me suggestions in the comments. I would love to see that. And uh, of course, subscribe if you haven't. I will see you in the next one. Peace.